Hi guys, welcome back to Griffin's Gaming Guides. Today we're going to carry on with our legendary look guide for Borderlands 3. This time we're looking at the Nuclear Jericho Rocket Launcher. For those of you that are a fan of good old Mr. Tony Stark, obviously from the Marvel Cinematic Universe, this is a very nice homage to him. The first missile you ever see fired in the Marvel Cinematic Universe is the Jericho. And this thing, obviously, takes its name from there. Even the red text. Which reads, I prefer that weapon you only need to fire once. Obviously, again, massive props to Tony Stark on this one. This has been dedicated to him wholeheartedly. And rightly so. This thing is absolutely incredible. If you've watched my Legendary Loot Guide episode on the Tunguska, you'll know that that was my favourite rocket launcher in Borderlands 3. And I do emphasise the was. This thing has taken its place and I just can't believe how powerful this is. You've got your standard firing mode, which is a launcher, which kind of fires a rocket up in the air that then explodes. Four grenades come down, they explode. It's all lovely. But this thing's party trick in its secondary fire mode, it's got a mortar. Now, for those of you that don't know what a mortar is, it's kind of a missile that fires up in the air and then lands somewhere over there dealing considerable damage this one fires four of them which then split into four so essentially you've got 16 projectiles that kind of cover a very large area if you've got any sort of enemy in the game be it a knightly militants be it a boss be it a group of enemies in front of you any of the legendary uh, rare hunts for sir hammerlock anything at all this thing will give them a very bad day. So stat-wise on the Jericho, you're looking at a damage of 2029, accuracy of 73%, handling in the 48%, a reload time of 4 seconds, a fire rate of 0.85 a second, magazine size of 8, and it will take all 8 as well. It says it consumes 2 ammo a shot, but to be honest, with the spread, you really don't feel that. It's got plus 15% weapon fire rate and plus 518 splash damage radius. That does apply to every single projectile that fires, either in launcher or mortar mode. So again, this thing is absolutely devastating. Now, I found a couple of these Jerichos. Every time I found one, it's been in the Vault of the Grave Ward on Mayhem 2. It doesn't seem to drop anywhere else or on any other Mayhem mode. Mayhem 2, Vault of the Grave Ward. Get yourself on it, get down there, get yourself a Jericho as soon as you can. Because for me, in Borderlands 3, this is quite simply the ultimate powerhouse for covering AoE. It's just, I can't gush about this weapon enough. You need to get yourself one of these. You will not regret it. So guys, I'd just like to say thank you very much for watching. If you like what you see, please hit the like button. Let me know down in the comment section if you managed to find your own version of the Jericho. If you managed to find it anywhere else apart from the Vault of the Grave Ward on Mayhem 2, let us know down in the comment section. Hopefully it'll help someone else get one of theirs. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. After you subscribe, please hit the notification bell so you don't miss out on any of our future content. I'll see you on the next one. Take care.